There's a little less help when it comes to recycling in Overland Park, at least for now. TVs, microwaves, computers, boom boxes where you can still press play. Although when it comes to recycling, you'll have to press pause on these electronics. This is a huge deal. Went from where they might have been making a few cents per pound for those materials to where maybe it's costing them 15, 20 cents a pound to, to move it forward. Friday was the last day Overland Park residents could drop off electronics at the city's recycling center. Thank you. The vendor city leaders use is experiencing a downturn in the market. So recycling some of those shiny objects and paperweights doesn't give them a return on shiny coins and paper money. Much to the chagrin of residents like Pat Zielinski. It's convenient for us. It's a one-stop recycle center. We can recycle everything. So why not bring the electronics out here? I just wish there was a better market for the electronics. And I don't know what we can do about that. What do you suppose this cost new? This might have been 800 bucks or something. I know. So you think, what's the value of all that stuff in there? City leaders say making one of these computers creates more than four tons of waste. That's why they're working at finding an alternative. And that can't come soon enough for Zelensky. We don't want to throw them in the landfills. We need some place to recycle them, and this is convenient. Well, the Overland Park Recycling Center collects more than 200,000 pounds of electronics every year. Here's the hope. The hope is to find a viable solution soon, and when that happens, we'll of, co- of course let you know. In the meantime, city leaders are referring residents to the Surplus Exchange location, 518 Santa Fe Street, the address in KC Mo, but you will have to pay a fee.